All right, so you've landed the client, you got the contract, you read and understood the contract, good job, and you signed it. You did everything you're supposed to do, and you completed the work on time. You finally send that invoice, but now the due date for that invoice has come and passed, and your bank account remains empty. So what do you do? You know, when a client has to pay on time, what next steps should you take? First, realize that chances are it's an oversight. They probably aren't doing this maliciously, even though it may feel that way, um, because you're probably depending on the money. Most people aren't out to get you. Um, second, send them a follow-up email. It could be they just, it was an oversight, or it could be someone's doing their bookkeeping and is behind, whatever it is. Send them an email to follow up and make it clear that this is due and they need to pay it. You know, it doesn't need to be long. You know, it doesn't, it shouldn't be rude. Just be direct. Um, so something like, hey, I noticed that my invoice dated this date for X amount of money was due this date, has yet to be paid. Do you know when I can expect payment? Question mark. That's it. Um, if you don't receive a response, then consider calling them directly if you have a phone number. If not, then you might have to move on to another more um, serious step. Um, like I said, it's possible the business owner just isn't aware that the invoice is due. So a clear and direct conversation similar to the email you tried if you're able to call them um, should hopefully resolve it as well. If the business owner is not responsive to your email or your phone calls then, or is negatively responsive, then it's time to start consider hiring an attorney. Um, now it doesn't mean you're suing them just yet. The first step for, with an attorney would be to have them send a demand letter. Sometimes just showing that you're willing to take that step will scare a business owner enough to, to pay the money due because they don't want to have to deal with a whole lawsuit. Um, while it sounds similar to the email you sent, having it sent by an attorney can ha sort of, like I said, have that extra weight behind it so that, um, you know, it's taken more seriously. You shouldn't have to do that, <laughs> right? People should pay their invoices on time, but taking that step can usually do the trick. Um, if it doesn't do the trick, then the attorney will probably advise you on what your next best step is. Um, so it's likely a lawsuit or some other legal recourse. It'll depend on your situation, depend on the attorney you talk to, you know. Um, so hopefully it never has to go that far. But now you know what to do if a client fails to pay you on time. So remember, reach out, be direct, be friendly. Chances are it was an oversight, but don't just be waiting. Actually say something. Chances are or they sometimes they thought they paid it, and it turns out they didn't. I had that happen to me recently. So Reach out, be clear, direct, be friendly, and then that doesn't work, you know, look at hiring an attorney and taking some more serious steps. But that's what to do if you don't have your invoice paid on time.